Yeah, I couldn't believe uh, Channel Lock still makes pliers made in the USA. And uh, I picked up a set of these when I was in Walmart. It says, something made in the USA. It says it right here on the tool itself. You can read it anywhere. Probably not. Probably, I don't think you can read that. It's made in the USA. It says it on a package made in the USA. But uh, these actually predate um, the vice grips, which now Irwin is selling them out to China. Um, but when you take something off with these, these will actually grip better than vice grips a lot of times. Um, in other words, when you put these on there like this, like the, on, a, on a pipe or stripped out bolt, you want to go like this and say it's on there like that, right? You want to go that way. Okay, because it'll grip in. If you go the opposite way, they slip off. You want to go that way. Okay. All right. So it's uh, it's kind of like I don't think about. I want to use these. I have another pair of them someplace, but uh, these are a little bit bigger than one of the other ones I have. But these will actually grip. A lot of times they'll grip a lot better than even the vice grips, and they've been around for decades and decades and decades and good to see they're made in the United States of America so but you know what else these are good for too sounds stupid but say for instance you're in the kitchen and you can't get a jar off <laughs> this thing these things will open up pretty big these are this is a pretty good size one uh, that'll do it <laughs> that'll do it you know big old jelly jar or something whatever the hell it is it's on there really tight these will open up pretty big and um, so the ones with the blue handles you really want. There's a lot of imitators around here, but the one that's, you know, this is, you know I just went down to Walmart and I said, I wonder if there's any tools in this place. If I, I saw some tools before. I got the uh, little pry bar. It was uh, made in, uh, they're made in the USA. It's made in the USA. I got some more vice grips coming, but not the vice grip. They're, they're, uh, these, are these are old vice grips from Irwin. Made in the USA, now they're in China, so I'm not buying them. I got some coming from uh, Armstrong. Twice as much as the ones from China, but I'm picking them up anyway. So um, this, But you'll be surprised, and a lot of people ignore this tool because it doesn't seem like it would grip the bolt that good. But uh, let me turn this light back on again. <laughs> That's my uh, light sensor back here. It doesn't seem like it would grip the bolt that good. But actually, it does. These grip. A lot of people say they grip more than vice grips. When you're starting, to, when they start turning and they start digging in, they'll grip more than vice grips. It doesn't seem like it will, but sometimes these will work where vice grips don't even work. A lot of people don't know that. I, I say pretty much everybody grabs the vice grips. They don't realize that these, this older tool, a lot of times, is better. But you want to get the original one. The channel lock with the blue, very power. It's very strong, and uh, it's actually simpler to use because when you want to release it, I mean, it's no problem. There's none of this, you know, fiddle. Yeah, you know, I mean, these are good too, these virus grips, but there's no fiddling around with this thing. Sometimes you got to really push on that lever to release it. So anyway, one other thing that's still made in the United States. Screw Wall Street. Screw the corporations, man. You know what I mean?